Welcome back everyone to my channel. In this video, we are going to configure the VLANs and sub interfaces in 48 Firewall. As you can see in this topology, we have three zones WAN, DMZ and LAN. So we are going to configure the VLANs and sub interfaces in LAN and DMZ zone network. And I hope you will enjoy this video. If you do, do not forget to like, comment and share and also subscribe this channel. And please click on the bell icon to get new notifications. So whenever I upload any new video, you will get the notification. So let's get start configuring VLANs and SAV interfaces according to this topology. But before configuring, I want to show you something in this diagram that we have 40 gate and we are going to create two SAV interfaces under port 2, under this port, port 2. And then we are going to create VLAN 16 and 17. This end workstation is going to be VLAN 16 and this one is going to be VLAN VLAN 17. And also in DMZ zone network, this DMZ Win 6 is going to be VLAN 18 and also AD server is going to be falling under VLAN 18. And also we are going to create VLANs over here in the switch. So we are going to create two VLANs in switch 3. And also we will create SVI switch virtual interface, which is layer three interface VLAN interface for getting communication between this FortiGate and switch three for testing purpose. But this is optional. You can create SVI interface if you want, but even in switch three also, we are going to create VLAN 18, VLAN 18 over here. So this is going to be VLAN 16 and VLAN 17 over here in switch 3 and also this interface ethernet 0 slash 0 is going to be a trunk interface for switch 4 and 3 as well and in switch 3 we are going to configure this ethernet 0 slash 1 it will be falling under for vlan 16 which is going to be access port vlan 16 and ethernet 0 slash 3 will be falling under vlan 17 so let's get start configuring vlan and virtual interface sub interfaces in 40 gate firewall admin and admin 1 to 3 network section and then interfaces we are going to create new sub interface so if you click on interface and then you will find that vlan we are going to create vlan vlan 16 sub interface an alias I'm going to give this is falling under LAN and type is going to be VLAN interface this sub interface is going to be under LAN port 2 and VLAN ID is going to be 16 IP address I am giving 192.168.16.1 slash 24 and administrative access I want to have HTTP as ping SSH click on OK so I have created one sub interface under LAN you can see if you click on this plus sign then you will have LAN which is VLAN 16. This is going to be the sub interface under LAN port 2 and I'm going to have one more sub interface which is VLAN 17. VLAN 17 and alias is going to be LAN 17 also I am going to have LAN and type is going to be VLAN interface I want to have LAN and then VLAN ID is going to be 17 and role is LAN IP address is going to be 192.168.17.1 slash 24 HTTPS ping and SSH and let's go ahead and click on OK so I have created two sub interfaces and also I want to create one more sub interface for DMZ zone network. So this is going to be VLAN 18. VLAN 18 and alias is going to be DMZ. Type is going to be VLAN and interface. This is going to be under DMZ port 3 and VLAN ID is going to be 18 and role is going to be DMZ. IP address 192.168.18.1 slash 24 HTTPS ping and SSH click on OK so let me go back to this topology that I have created two sub interfaces VLAN 16 and 17 over here in under port 2 so 16 
I am going to have for this machine LAN Win PC and 17 this is going to be 16 and then 17 is going to be for this PC 17 and I have created VLAN 18 for this PC and also for this server 18 and 18 if you click on this plus sign to expand this DMZ interface you will see that I have created VLAN 18 sub interface under port 3 so now I have to configure this switch switch 3 switch 3 config T and first I am going to configure Ethernet interface Ethernet 0 slash 0 switch port mode mode trunk oops it's uh, rejected because switch port trunk encapsulation dot 1q I have to execute this one switch port trunk encapsulation dot 1q and then switch port mode trunk no shutdown so Ethernet 0 slash 0 is going to be the trunk towards to the firewall 40 gate firewall port 2 and then and now I'm going to configure to VLANs VLAN 16 and VLAN exit and then VLAN 17 now I have to assign interface 0 slash 1 is going to be under switch port mode access and then switch port access VLAN is going to be 16 exit and then interface Ethernet let me show you interface Ethernet 0 slash 3 is going to be VLAN switch port mode access first and then VLAN is going to be 17 and then interface I'm going to create SVI interface interface VLAN 16 IP address 192.168.16.2 followed by 24 video mask no shutdown and then I'm going to create one more SVI interface which is interface VLAN 17 and then IP address is going to be 17.2 no shutdown and then write so I am going to configure switch 4 so here enable config T interface Ethernet 0 slash 0 switch port trunk encapsulation dot 1q switch port mode trunk and now interface I have to create VLAN VLAN is going to be 18 interface and now I'm going to assign the the interface which is Ethernet 0 slash 1 and 3 interface Ethernet 0 slash 1 switch port mode access switch port access VLAN is going to be 18 same thing for Ethernet 0 slash 3 access and then VLAN 18 Oops, I have to configure this VIN also this is going to be the optional interface VLAN is going to be 18 IP address 192.168.18.2255.255.255.0 no shutdown so I have created show IP interface brief that my VLAN interface is up as you can see so I should be able to reach show interface show interface trunk as you can see 1 and 18 is allowed ping 192.168.18.1 this is my SVI interface in 40 gate firewall I should be able to reach as you can see and then from switch 3 192.168.16.1 yes and then 17.1 as well 17.1 I have connectivity video in switch and firewall now let's configure IP address in uh, LAN win 5 now there it is properties and then this is VLAN 16 192.168.16. I'm gonna have 3 16.3 so one and two I'm going to use in switch and one is going to be my gateway so I can use three my gateway is going to be 192.168.16.1 and this piece is well LAN win for VLAN 17 for VLAN 17 I'm going to assign ncpa.cpl 
properties and then IP version 4. Here I'm going to assign 192.168.17.3, 192.168.17.1. And DNS, I'm going to have Google DNS. Okay, now I'm going to assign IP address for DMZ Win 6. This is going to be 192.168.18.3, dot one is my gateway. DNS 8.8.8.8 .8 and I'm going to configure the server. Ethernet and properties IP version 4. Here I'm going to use 18.5. Yes, I can use 4 and 18.1 and DNS I'm going to use 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 Google DNS click on OK click on close and I am going to show you now that my VLAN is working that 192.168.18.1 you can see I can reach 18.1 ping 8.8.8.8 .8 .8. as you can see I'm not able to reach this Google to this internet because I haven't even in from DMZ 6 win 6 I'm going to show you that I don't have internet connectivity but I can reach my gateway ping 192.168.18.1 I can reach my gateway ping google.com you can see I have no internet connection or ping 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 likewise this is going to be this is happening in LAN zone network also because I haven't configured security policies. So admin and then admin 123. So I'm going to configure security policies in firewall 40 gate firewall for VLANs, policy and objects section and then security policies. Create new and here is going to be VLAN 16 to WAN. Incoming interface is going to be VLAN 16 and outgoing is going to be WAN source I'm going to have all anything and destination is also going to be all anything so I have created one security policies that traffic will go from VLAN 16 to WAN and I'm going to have one more security policy VLAN 17 to WAN VLAN 17 to WAN and source is going to be anything even destination is also anything click on OK so I have to create a security policy for VLAN 18 as well VLAN 18 to WAN so incoming interface is going to be VLAN 18 which is under DMZ outgoing is going to be WAN because I want to have internet connection through this WAN interface port 1 from V from VLAN 18 so source is going to be anything and destination is also going to be anything click on OK so I have created three security policies and then I have to create the net as well create a new net so this is going to be LAN VLAN 16 VLAN 16 incoming VLAN 16 and outgoing when port 1 source anything destination is also anything click on OK so I have created a NAT from 16 VLAN 16 and now I am going to create a VLAN, VLAN 17 VLAN 17 and outgoing is going to be port 1 source address is going to be all and destination address is also going to be all click on OK now I am going to create a security policy for VLAN 18 VLAN 18 DMZ VLAN 18 and then outgoing is going to be WAN port 1 source all and destination is also going to be all click on OK and let me go back to the security policy let me go back to the topology I'm going to open Win 5 and let me check the connectivity internet connectivity LAN Win 5 and here I'm going to check google.com as you can see I'm going to check google.com ping google.com oops ping google.com as you can see I have internet connection and I'm going to show you from browsing websites for example CNN 
so I should be able to reach CNN and from I'm going to check from VLAN 17 PC that I have internet connectivity so I'm going to check from VLAN 17 ping google.com yes I have so I have the internet connection and then I'm going to check from DMZ win 6 ping google.com I should be able to reach google.com and then ping 8.8.8 .8 yes I have so likewise I'm going to have from this server as well so let me go back to this topology that yes I have created to SVI VLAN 16 and then IP address interface VLAN 16 and then IP address I'm going to have 192.168.16.1 and then VLAN 17 192.168.17.1 likewise in DMZ zone I'm going to have one sub interface in 40 gate firewall which is VLAN 18 and then IP address I'm going to have 192.168.18.1 this is going to be the gateway for this machine and then this machine as well and 16 I'm going to use for this machine this is going to be the gate 16 16.1 is the gateway and then 17.1 I'm going to use for this machine so this is the gateway 192.168.17.1 for VLAN 17 gateway and 192.168.16.1 gateway is for VLAN 16 and 18 I'm going to have 192.168.18.1 and if you have any questions any doubt do let me know so I will try to respond to your questions as early as possible I hope this video has been informative for you guys if you like this video do not forget to like comment and share and also subscribe this channel and please click on the bell icon to get new notifications so whenever I upload any new video you will get the notification. Thank you for watching.